So oysters, I celebrate with oysters. Mm. I celebrate with caviar. So we're going to do a little dish Yum. that sort of has a little New Orleans flavor of Rockefeller, which is spinach and perno predominantly. And so I'm here gonna we go. I'm going to introduce you to Mr. Rockefeller one of these days. Okay. The last living brother of David. He's okay. amazing. I was going to okay. ask you to see if you could make a little creme fraiche for me okay. with salt and pepper. Okay. And the shallots perfume about uh, maybe about four or five minutes, folks. And then what we're going to do is we're going to start a very simple sauce by adding cream. Just a little cream, three cups. <clears throat> it's three cups of friends. This is celebratory. And then you drain the oysters, and I love this. This is the oyster liqueur, the oyster water, oh, yes. right? Yep. So we're going to add some of this in here. Our prep Actually, kitchen was busy shucking the oysters fresh for you today. No. I, I happened to walk in, so I knew there was oysters in the menu, and I and I knew there were also there was you also cheated. duck. No, I didn't cheat. You I just cheated. happened to go in, and of course you and can't then, help And then about see. a cup of perno. <gasps> a cup. Now, when okay. I when I did this dish. Uh, in New Orleans, we have herb saint, uh, and you know it's. Uh, I keep that in my liquor cabinet because with I, the worm. Uh, oh yes, because you know I'm why. I'm coming to your house. Oh yeah, I have all that stuff because um, I really, really love that Sazerac. Absence would say Sazerac. Oh. All of that stuff is yeah, fabulous. That, so those drinks are, uh, but you know, prepare Classic. yourself. If you drink those drinks, you're going to stay home and. Eat oysters. Right, right. You're not going and, anywhere. And, and then a little caviar. That's right. So, okay, so we're going to reduce this by half, which okay. is going to be about 20 minutes. And this is what it looks like. Oh, yeah, look. And, folks, see, it just, like, starts to cover the back of the spoon. Right. Okay? Now what we're going to do, let's have a little seasoning in here, Martha. We're going to have a little salt. I know the oysters are going to be salty. Do you know? You can, you kick, know? It, you can kick it up a notch, Emerald. You're being I'm, very... I'm going to. He's I'm being to. very refined. All right, so now... Now what we're going to do is we're going to add about, oh, about a half pound of spinach. Yum. Let that wilt in there. All the nutrients go in there. Once that happens and the spinach works in it and it starts cooking, okay. then what we're going to do is we're going to take a little hand mixer or the boat motor. Okay. And we're going to actually puree that. Okay. And, and then, that has to cook a little bit yes. more. Yes. Yeah. And so what happens is that becomes the sauce. So you got this sort of licorice anise flavor with the spinach, a little mm. bit of the green color. And the and color is, it, it, from what I beautiful. see over there, yes. see, I'm very observant, Emerald. You're going to add, add the all rest that? Of this? Yeah, add all yeah, the I spinach. Yeah, like, I like spinach. Yeah, you add all the spinach in here. Believe it or not, it will cook down and it will incorporate okay. in that. Now, the other part of this spinach thing that we're going to do, Martha, you got to make sure that it's not only washed but also very dry, is we're going to fry some spinach. Okay, lovely. Okay? And while you're doing that, I have the oysters... Look at how beautiful They're these so oysters plump, are. They're so plump, yeah. And what you want to do is you don't want to yeah. overcook them. You want to cook them just to the sides begin to start curling. You're going to fry the oysters? No, we're oh. going to fry the spinach. Oh, okay. And I'm going to put the oysters right now inside of our sauce. Okay. Okay? So, folks, this is the sauce right here oh, yum. that we pureed. Look at this wonderful color. Oh, beautiful. Okay? Oh, yes, so that's, indeed. That's this with the spinach in it, all pureed, and you use a... If you have one of these, don't you love this? I love that. Yeah, this is a wonderful, wonderful. And it comes in like little... high and low speed, and you know, it just it's it's fantastic. All right, so mm. we're gonna fry some spinach. Okay. But yeah, yeah, make sure now is it the right heat, you think? Or I think it's the right okay. heat. Let's try one piece, okay, and see. Almost. Almost. Just... We'll turn it up a little bit. Okay. And so how long does it fry? It fries for maybe about 30, 45 seconds. Do it. Well, right. this is how, but look how pretty it looks. It's all crispy and, and it gets like crispy, paper. And then you lightly salt it. And then what I'm going to do, while Martha's doing that, I'm just going to start the presentation of our oysters, kind of like little spokes here. They, see, the, uh, mm. the, the edges just started to curl, and they're still plump, and that's important. And a, a little bit of that sauce, okay? And so now this is going to go right. You know, when I there. watch Emeril on his programs, I always watch him doing this, and it's so intense. You, you are the chef. <laughs> you are making sure everything is so perfect. That black oh. pepper creme oh. fresh that Martha made down there when we first started. Yeah. A right. little bit in that in the, of the center. Wow. Okay. Oh yes. And then now, right at the end, we're going to take some of the sauce, spoon a little right over the oysters to get it nice and hot. And then what we're going to do is take some really good quality American spoon oh, caviar. Yep. Do you okay? use the American Ocetra? Yes. Oh, I love and that. And this is, and then watch this. We're going to have a little here. Oh, on each oyster? Yep. <gasps> good. Done, done with the mother of pearl okay. spoon. And don't forget, we're celebrating. We're celebrating. Nothing I hate more than skimpy caviar. No, no, you can't have skimpy caviar. 
So then what we're going to do now is we're going to... Don't give me a tin of caviar. No, me either. Because I eat the whole thing. We'll be dangerous, you and I, with a tin of caviar. Okay, so we got that. Now, mm. Martha, if you could just take a little bit of the fried spinach for me. Okay. So this is almost mm. fried in here, but ooh, where do you want it? And they're going to put a little pile right in the center for me. A little more. Okay. Oh, it's so crispy and nice. See, and we'll just pile that up just as a little okay. garnish like that. Beautiful. And there's the first dish oh. of our celebration, ladies and gentlemen. 